This is Greg Fisher, lead instructor for Fire Attack and Acquired Structures at this year's Fire Department Instructors Conference, Hands-On Training. With over 40 years of experience in the fire service, I retired as a command officer after filling multiple roles on a fire department in a Big Ten University town. As an instructor at the State Fire Academy, my roles included technical rescue, firefighting, industrial response, hazmat, and I was the Explorer Cadet Training Coordinator as well. I've been a brigade leader for an industrial fire or emergency response team, and I served as the fire chief for a fire protection district in central Illinois. You've all read the articles and seen the videos of house burns gone bad, unsafe behavior, unplanned or unintended property damage, career-ending injuries and deaths related to makeshift light and fights in houses not meant for living in, let alone conducting fire training with live fire. With continuing successful fire prevention and public education efforts, the on-the-job live fire training we remember from the 1970s and 80s has diminished for firefighters and company officers. Exposure to live fire in buildings not engineered for Class A fuels or piped with flammable gas has become, for many, the only training available or been reduced to playing with simulators. Whether due to actual or perceived safety issues, environmental concerns, lack of available property, the possibility some historical figure may have slept there, or just due to something stupid some fire department has done in the past, our ability to train in actual live fire conditions, even in areas where live burn training and acquired structures is permitted, is rapidly going by the wayside. This hot class, Fire Attack and Acquired Structures, will take the students through between 8 and 10 live fire evolutions. Time between drills will walk you through some of the on-scene planning, the building preparation, and the execution of live burn training in the field. As a part of a live fire team, you will participate on a fire attack crew, a fire control team, backup hose line, a rapid intervention team, and truck crews responsible for interior search and rescue, as well as vertical or horizontal ventilation. Transitional fire attack methods will be practiced and discussion of the ramifications of the flow path will occur during the evolution and also during the critiques. There's little downtime per se since between each evolution a critique of each drill will follow or allow the student to evaluate their skills and understand their assigned roles. During one of the evolutions you'll shadow the command or management group consisting of the lead instructor, safety officer, fire control or ignition team, EMS and water supply. Crews will go over the latest edition of NFPA 1403 and rehab recommendations, critique the drill from the standpoint of your assigned positions. With a substantial amount of hands-on work in the eight hours, you'll also receive information normally handed or handled in the classroom. Additionally, we'll point to you in the right direction for getting the administrative aspects addressed in NFPA 1403. An additional segment of the class will allow 14 instructors to arrive two days early to prepare the acquired structure, document objectives for each drill, and be mentored through leading the team through a live fire evolution during one of the two hot days of training. Combining the weekend activities with a hot class will document many of the points required of the hands-on portion of task books or checklists to qualify as a live fire instructor for acquired structures, as required by numerous fire training entities, professional organizations, and local jurisdictions. If you're just looking to get your dear gear dirty, this is not the class for you. If you, as an experienced firefighter, instructor, or officer with a live fire background, want to be a part of a class on how live fire training in the field can be safe, efficient, and effective, then come spend some time with a team from all over the country with hundreds of years of combined firefighting and fire training experience. Bring your gear. We'll have the SCBA. See you at FDIC Hot, and be safe. Never forget.